Hello everyone! In this video, I will introduce you to the new Illustrator extension called Gridit. To enable it, go to Window, Extensions, and then Gridit. You don't have to do this next step, but I'm not a fan of floating windows, so I'm just going to stack it into my right panel. It's just more convenient for me that way. I'll use one of the logos that I made for a client of mine to show you all the current features of this extension. The options that this extension offers are anchors, handles, outlines, and grid lines. Let's start with anchors. To use it, first select your design, click on the anchors button, and then click generate. Two things happen to the design you selected. First, anchors in the form of little squares were added. Second, a new layer named anchors was added, and all the generated anchors are located on this layer. So these are separate squares that can be deleted or moved if need be. The purpose of this feature would be just to show you where your anchors are located or to generate a cool image to showcase your design structure. The next option works pretty much in the same manner, but instead of anchors, it generates handles. Likewise, all handles are located on a new layer and can be selected separately. Of course, both anchors and handles can be generated together. The more options you select, the more layers will be added. The outline generates cool outlines of your design with calm colors for fill and stroke. Let's see how design looks with generated anchors, handles, and outlines. Now comes the most important feature of this extension, grid lines. Select grid lines, click generate and see the magic happen. As you can see, the extension generated grid lines based off the geometry of your design. Pretty cool, isn't it? You can click Generate All to see all the features in action. You can use the generated grid lines to edit the original design, but with following all the source material geometry. Please note that this extension is new to the market and currently is in beta release and hence is still under development. For example, my design actually has circular grids too. I represented some of them with red color. Grid it currently can generate or let's say reverse engineer the arcs and circles. Hopefully they will add it into their future releases. You can use it free for seven days and after you'll need to purchase a subscription. See the description on how to get a discount. So yeah, this was it. Thanks for watching.